Hey, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can build an automation to send out order confirmations or other messages to customers when new orders come in. The automation we are going to build consists of two parts. The first part is creating a WhatsApp template in SuperChat, and the second part is building the automation in Sapio. We will start with the template. For that, we go into SuperChat, click on our profile, and on the sidebar, click on WhatsApp templates. Here, we will create a new WhatsApp template. You can customize it however you like. For now, we've prepared a simple template where the customer receives information that their order has been received and their tracking ID will be available soon. You will also find this text in the article below and you can use it how you like. Afterwards, you can submit the template. It will be reviewed by Meta and should be available within a few minutes. That's basically the first part that's done. Next, we move over to Sapier and begin the building of the automation. If you haven't done so already, you will need to create a Sapier account and then create a new SAP. We've already set up the automation, so we are going to go through it step by step so you can build along. We start the automation with a trigger. In our case, this means that every time a new order is detected, the automation will be active. Quick note before we continue, since we get phone numbers from Shopify in different formats, we have to first format them correctly. If you always get numbers with a country code, you can skip a few steps and jump ahead to the WhatsApp template action. Let's head back to automation. After the trigger, we have a formatter step by Sapier. With this step, we pull the country code of each customer from Shopify to set the respective country prefix. This way we can process any phone number from those countries. You can set this up based on where your customers are located, however you like. Once that's done, we can move on to the next step, where we split the automation into two parts. In the first path, we set the rule that this path should be chosen if the input phone number starts with a plus. If that's the case, the next step sends out a WhatsApp template. For this, just select the Super Chat Send WhatsApp Template action and connect to your account. To connect to the account, you will need the API key, which you can find under integrations in the Super Chat settings. Once you've done that, you can configure the WhatsApp template you created earlier to be sent to the phone number. If, like us, you've also used a variable, you can fill it in here with the correct input. In our case, this input comes from Shopify. Now we are done with the first path and we can move on to the second one. Here we specify that if the phone number starts with 0 or 00, zero this path should be used. Then we add a run code by Sapia run Python step where we enter the phone number as input, call it phone and then paste in the code. You can find this code in the article too. After that, we add a second code by Sapia run Python step, where we use the output from step nine run Python as input and call it RP, as well as the output from the fourth formatter step, which we name utilities node output. Here too, you can just paste in the code from the article. What we've done here is remove the zero or double zero from the phone number in the first step and in the next step we append the respective country code so the phone number is complete. Now we have a complete phone number and we can add a super chat send whatsapp template action to send the whatsapp template. The setup is the same as in the previous path. And that's it, we've built the entire automation and your customers will now receive a message whenever they place an order. 